602 is your time, and we do want to get to this story this morning. It was a wild scene at a Detroit gas station that got so intense. You see a woman there with a gun just spraying bullets all over the place at this West Side Detroit gas station. Nick Monticelli is following this story for us this morning, and the good news about all this is that, Nick, I understand that that woman is in police custody. That woman is in police custody, Rhonda. The Detroit Police Department issued that video last night saying they needed help tracking her down. She has since been taken into custody. But when you see this video, or you may have seen it already, it is just crazy, bizarre to see somebody randomly shooting into a car with no care for human life. It is safe to say Detroit police are happy to have this woman in custody who fired several shots at a group of men early Sunday morning. It happened just before 4.30 a.m. at a mobile gas station on the corner of Fenkel and Greenfield on Detroit's west side. That woman was spotted on camera talking to a group of guys outside of this blue Dodge Charger. Then the Green Pontiac Grand Prix pulls up. Police say whatever was said agitated the woman to the point that she rushes to the glove box to get a gun. Her friend tries to stop her. That does not work, and the woman hides the gun in her underwear. Next, another man tries to defuse the situation, but that is when the woman starts shooting. The man pushes her hand away, and the woman's friend falls to the ground. Police say the gunshot scared the driver of the Grand Prix, who almost ran over that woman's friend. The driver was hit multiple times. His friends somehow get the gun away from the woman and they take off. And less than 24 hours later, she is now locked up. It's unclear if she was found and arrested or if she turned herself in. The things that can be caught on camera. That woman is scheduled to be arraigned facing a judge for the first time sometime today. We are live this morning. Nick Monticelli, Local 4 News Today.